Hi guys, let's start the next question. That's question number seven. So let's read the question. Use graph paper for this question. Perfect. The table given below shows the monthly wages of some factory workers. So these are the wages. Using the table, calculate the cumulative frequencies of workers. Perfect. So number of workers is 10, 18, 22, 25, 17, 10 and 8. Let's calculate cumulative frequency. So there will be 10, 10 plus 18, 28, 28 plus 22, that's 50, 50, 50 plus 25, that's 75, 85, 92, so that's 102, and that's 110. Let's check if my answer is correct. 10, 15, 22, 30, 0, 3, 3, 4, 5, 7, 9, 10, 11. Perfect, my answer is correct. So that's 110. So we've calculated the cumulative frequency. Next one, uh, draw a cumulative frequency curve. So we need to draw a cumulative frequency curve. Let's see if something else is given. Use 2 cm is equal to rupees 500, starting the origin at 6500 on x axis. Ah, so they want the origin not at 0 but at 6500 on the origin. So, uh, since this is given, I can't take my own uh, scale. Since the scale is given in the question, I have to take the scale which is mandated in the question. If I take any other scale, then I lose, I get completely zero. So, they've given me a scale, I need to use that scale. Uh, please note that I do not have a uh, let's say I don't have a scale here so I am using a free hand you will notice that this line is not too correct but anyway this is 6500 as per the question and starting the origin of at 6500 on x-axis and 2 centimeters equal to 10 workers on the y-axis ah everything that I wrote has gone I will have to rewrite let's check so that's 10 18 22, 25, 17, 10, 8. This was 110. This is 10, 28, 50, 75, 92, 102, 110. What do I plot? I plot, if you remember the 7, so the first one is 6500 with 0. The next one is 7000 with 10. The next one is 7500 with 28. Next one is 8000 with 50. Next is 8500 8, with 75. This is 9000 with 92. 9500 with 102 and 10,000 with 110. Perfect. Now, like I was saying, they've given the scale. So, starting the x-axis at 6,500 and taking 2 centimeters equal to rupees 500. So, this is 7k, less space. So, I'm writing k. This is 7.5k, which is 1,000. This is 8k. This is 8.5k. This is 9k. This is 9.5k. This is 10k. Perfect. And what have I plotted? I have plotted wages in rupees. Perfect. This is my x-axis. Perfect. Now let's see what do they want on the y-axis. It says 2 centimeters equal to 10 workers on the y-axis. So I need to go up to 110. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110. Perfect. So I will just reach the last one. This is my y-axis and let me put the numbers now. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 and 110. 
this is number of workers going up in this direction perfect now let's see six and a half thousand is zero so this is my zero for this and six and a half thousand for this so this is zero you notice that i have separate i have separate starting point for the x and y so this is zero on the y axis but this is six and a half thousand on the x axis allowed seven thousand with ten simple seven and a half with twenty eight which is eight more than twenty so this is the eighth point then is eight and eight thousand with fifty eight thousand with fifty next is eight and a half thousand with seventy five so that's five more than 70 that's the middle one next is 9000 with 92 so 9000 with 92 two more than 90 next is nine and a half thousand with 102 so two more than 100 that's this point and then the last one is 110 perfect this is a, a cumulative frequency curve also known as ojive and it's a curve which means i don't have to use a scale i just have to use my free hand to please note that i have not been able to draw this properly perfect so i've been able to join all of them in a slightly free hand this is not this one is not exactly perfect but anyway let's move on so i need the last thing i need to do is write the scale so on the scale it's given in the question in any case so that the same scale on x axis 2 cm is equal to rupees 500 and on y axis 2 cm is equal to 10 workers let's check if i have done everything possible x axis done this done y axis scale done and i have written I told you that this is also known as less than ojai. Let's look at this question. This question says less than ojai would mean that 110 workers scored or not scored were paid less than 10,000. 50 workers were paid less than 8,000. 10 workers were paid less than 7,000. This is this gives me a less than data. Thank you. I'll see you on the next question.